Hello everyone, welcome back to Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central introductory course. This is lecture 5 of third module where we will explore more about the list pages in Dynamics 365 Business Central. In previous lecture, we have seen the My Settings area of Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central and in this lecture we will take a closer look on the list pages. So as you know that list pages shows multiple records and it displays the selected information for those multiple records. So let me now open the trial instance and we will explore more about list pages. These are the different lists. So let me now open a customers list. So now you can see that it has displayed a list of customers that are active in my business central but it has given me the selected information like the customer number, name, responsibility center, location code, phone number, contact, balance, balance due and sales, sales, payments, CFDI purpose and CFDI relations. So this selected information but for multiple records. So the same thing you will find in the vendors list or items list as well. This is the vendors list. You will find the selected information but for multiple records like in the vendors list as well. You will find the vendor number, name, location code, phone number, context, search name, balance. So this is selected information displayed for multiple records. And you will have many such lists in your Dynamics 365 Business Central. You have customers list, vendors list, items list where the story repeats itself again and again. The selected information for multiple records. Similarly, you have list of bank accounts, chart of accounts, and you will find so many such lists in your Dynamics 365 Business Center. So let us now have a closer look with other interesting features of list pages. So you can change the view in your contents by selecting different layout options. So right now the content is displayed in list layout. You can change to tall tiles as well. So where you can now see the images along with some other key information. You can also change the layout to tiles where the images are a bit shortened and you will find other useful information in the list pages. So let me change it back to the list view. Another interesting feature of list pages is that if you want to see more information about a particular record then you can see in the fact box now you can see the fact box gives you more detailed information about the selected record in the list page and if you keep on changing your selection then you can see the my fact box pane is updated and here also you can see more information about a particular record without opening a card page so let us now check the same thing on the customers list as well so here also you can change the layout to tall tiles or the simple tiles and right now you can hide and show the fact box pane by clicking here Similarly, if you change your selection here the content in fact box pane will also get changed to reflect that selection and along with that you will also have a command bar on the top of the list page where you can perform a specific action on the selected record you can search a particular record by clicking the search icon you can also delete a particular selected record and also you can trigger a process from this process action area you can run different types of reports for this selected record you can create number of documents from this action button similarly you can see the contacts associated with this customer and also you can open the same page in Excel or you can edit the same thing in Excel as well along with some different actions that are specific to this list page now you know the different components of list page how you can utilize it, and where you can find these different components of a list page in Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central so that brings the end of this module and in next module we will see the different user personalization option in Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central. I hope to see you all in the next module. Till then, bye bye and take care.